Hello everyone, I'm Whoopi. And I'm Neon. And we're that gaming couple. Hooray! We're back. Yes. It's been a while again. Yeah, this oh. is uh, episode 22 now. Yep, 22. <laughs> yes. Now we were a bit delayed in getting this episode to you again. Yeah, sorry. Yeah. My fault. Yeah. Because somebody was sick again. Yeah, but why? with good reason. Why, honey? Why? Tell me. Why? Or tell the rest. I already know, of course. <laughs> oh, wait. Yeah, I know too. Because I'm pregnant. Hooray. Hooray. Not for the sick part, but for the pregnancy itself. Hooray. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. So, yeah, that's why you haven't been very active. And didn't feel like playing a lot. One of the last episodes that we did do. Yeah. We did a put that mention. And we'd never play something on our pocket wall. No. So now I'm going to place the effect poker hat on there. Yeah, because I won. It but was either an evoker hat or a treasure map. Nobody won. We just decided to do the evoker hat. Nobody yes. voted. Yeah, but you agreed now. Yeah, that's true. I won. <laughs> you okay. always say yes to a pregnant lady, honey. Even okay, if you you're win. not right. Or you if win. I'm not right. Okay. <laughs> now you know. Yeah. Everybody else so, knows. <laughs> but since, yeah, you're not really up to playing a lot. No. We're gonna go to that, to the, the boat there, see what's on the boat, and then we're gonna <laughs> send you away. I'm gonna be off for a while, Cheshire yeah. hunting. So it will just be me, me for a while, doing episodes. Aye aye, Captain. So let's fly there. Okay. okay. Is it safe to fly for me? Did you fall down? I didn't, you somehow <laughs> didn't get my lighter on. <laughs> or I, it, it's on, but, but I... L l luckily, it's not in the end. Yeah. Not in lava. Or in the void. Mm -hmm. Like what happened. Yeah. Let's From talk here. About but let's see what's in the treasure chest. Emeralds. And lots of iron. And no map. Mm -hmm. No map? No map in there, right? Oh, oh yeah, here. the one. Oh, yeah. oh wait. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Is there a map in there? Not in this one. Please go to the other one. Wait, which one? Oh, I didn't see that Oh yeah, there's a there. very treasure map in there. Yes. Everything else. How do we that get out of there? You break the ship a little bit. But how can I sail away in a ship that's broken? Well, then you first just need to empty it. That sounds logical. I'm trying to fix it. <laughs> I'm, <laughs> I'm looking at the treasure. Ooh, it's a new one. And there there's already something visible. It's close by. But there's one issue, honey. Yeah. You're missing a sail and a mast. So you cannot really sail away. Hmm. So I guess that's what you'll be doing. Damn it. But I can just fly over. Okay, bye there. bye, honey. Good luck. But, but no goodbye kiss. See you. Nothing? Bye, honey. Okay, bye bye. Mm -mm. You just hit me. <laughs> Bye bye, honey. Mwah. Good luck. Bye. Love you. See you in six months. Mm. Oh, whenever you're uh. okay again. So I'm here at our Nether Fortress where the last time uh, we needed but Wither Skulls. We went to and we got finally got all the three skulls that we needed for the Wither. Um, and as you can see. There's already some structure done here, uh, because at the time, since it took so long, I thought, okay, just make a farm out of it. So I think I'm going to try and finish this farm so we can get more Wither Skulls. So this design is by Tango Tech, or at least I got it from Tango Tech. Uh, so first I'm going to cover this 
whole thing with slabs. Because that will be the roof. So I don't get attacked as much as uh, by uh, the crybabies. So I'm gonna do that right now. And I will get back to you when it's done. And somewhere there's already a crybaby now. I'm not happy about it. Probably shoot me off. But I've got a fire protection potion on me, just to be sure. But in case if he just shoot me into the lava void below, I can hopefully save myself. But oh, you never know. With the crybabies. I don't know exactly where it is. And I'm not gonna go look for it. At least not until I'm done with this piece. Alright, where are you crybaby? Let me shoot you in the face. I feel like it's below me somewhere, but it's not. It was. Sort of. Get a little bit lower. And there you've got another crybaby. Yes. Done it. Not sure if I got it by arrow or sending something back but it's fine so i'm finding a nice rhythm so what i do now for that roof is all the way across and then do like this every five instead of five of course now that i want to record it i make a mistake one two three oh and then i'm out of stones And that's how I do it. So I'm almost halfway done. Uh, this is basically the middle path that I will use. Walk back and forth and hopefully then they will spawn in the areas here next to it. Uh, but I thought I took one whole full chest of smooth stone with me, but apparently there's all kinds of crap in this box. So I have to go run back to our storage system and uh, Get some more smooth stone. And that is almost the whole roof finished. There you go. Nice big area covered. So at first I thought I was doing good work, but uh or that I was almost finished. And then I realized here is where I started. I thought this is the end. But then, of course, there is a path all the way here. I jumped in the fire. That extends the uh, bit of fortress a lot further than I initially thought. So I could extend it a little bit. Which is, of course, what I did. Which meant I had to mine a little bit out of the mountain. But it's fine. So I've got a nice big area now. I also set up a little center point. Uh, like I said, I'm working from the Tango Tech uh, Wither Skeleton Farm, uh, which uses a daylight sensor. But I'm going to use snow layers, since they're a lot cheaper and easier to get. And they 
are almost the same height. So I guess I need to pay, put four layers to stay at the same height so that the wither skeletons can still see me, but any other mobs mainly still see them there. The uh, places don't, so that I can safely run around here back and forth to spawn all the wither skeletons and then lure them there to the end caps where they'll be killed with a looting sword which I still need to get because this sword doesn't have looting so yeah I'm first just gonna extend this path for me all the way from there to there with all the snow layers and then all I need to do is cover this whole area with netherrack basically all but I did the roof just again oh yeah and then one more important part I need to cover all the surrounding area with well, probably most likely buttons because they're a bit easier to place you can just spam them around instead of using the hash slaps what I did at the first there they work the same as buttons of course but since you can oh that's not don't have any half steps anymore they basically stack on top of each other and buttons don't but first i need to fly back because i don't have any nether rack or stairs or whatever <laughs> so first fly back two when I got back, I found a nice surprise hiding in this spot, which was, of course, the crybaby surrounded by three pigmen, so I need to be careful when I shoot. And I was dead. Good. That could have been awkward if I shot one of the, those guys. <laughs> So I finished the center lane where I'm gonna be running up and down into. I did it took as many snow layers as I thought it would. I have a lot of snow layers left, which is nice because I can maybe use it for the next project, of course. Uh, I also added the outside wall or inside wall, depending how you look at it. Right now it's the inside wall uh, and the border around it where all the nether rack needs to be filled up. I haven't filled it up yet because first I want to make the collection point collection points at the uh, both ends because there's a crybaby there uh, so yeah I'm gonna do that first and then I'm gonna fill it up and then hopefully things will spawn some things have been spawning periodically on these parts when I was all the way on the other end so that's nice and of course this other wall, inner wall is to prevent Places like that guy there, or the crybaby that was just on the other side from shooting inside and blowing up things they shouldn't blow up. Mainly me dying again. But first, collection points. So I just finished the first floor and I was busy with the second floor, but I've ran out of uh, nether bricks. But at least it seems to be working as there are spawning some. With a skeleton right over there. There are three. Oh. Kill. Kill. Still don't have a looting sword, by the way, so no luck on uh, getting anything useful yet. And of course, I still need to cover that whole area there in buttons. But like I said, I ran out of nether bricks. Luckily there's a source pretty much nearby. So I'm gonna gather those resources and then I can finish this other side. And in total I think it took close to two shulker boxes to get this whole one floor finished. So still a lot of gathering to do. After about 32 stone swords I finally got a looting three enchantment possibility on a sword so I'm just killing endermen 
to get that enchantment. Of course, we found our nice little farm. Almost there. Yes. This one? Oh. I need. Go away, Ender Pearls. This one, and then Looting 3. And Smite 5. Then just combine it. Too expensive. Really? Hmm. I wasn't expecting that. So now I don't know what to do. But that's disappointing. Just throw some ender pearls in the void. Shall I get another? First put armor in Atron so I don't up to my death again into the void. What shall I do everybody? Will I get another sword? Or do I need to do something else completely? Just get yeah, get a new sword. Wow, it's too expensive, so what can I do? Should I just just that one for killing all the wither skeletons? Hmm. Decisions, decisions, decisions. Electro on. Jump to the void. Fly. Ah. So I've finished placing down the uh, other spawning platform. So I've got now two nice spawning platforms, but it doesn't seem to be working as efficiently as I hoped. Uh, there have been some wither skeleton spawning, but yeah rate is not so low and even moving back and forth doesn't seem to be spawning them i have this is my access hole by the way for now i need to make a better access hole i have um placed all buttons and all if i can fly i cannot fly on all the Nether rack that was in the area, which gives a nice effect. Um, but yeah, I also want to place all buttons around here so that at least all the zombie pigmen and whatever is could be spawning will be spawning there. When I'm moving further away, so GT zoom key. Yeah. So if you use GT zoom key, you can see now there are some mobs spawning there. So not sure if I'm just too close by or whatever maybe somebody in let me know in the comments but i will be placing more buttons on the outside here to prevent all spawning and then hopefully that will increase the rate of the farm so i hope yeah i really hope that works because otherwise all the time i spend on it will be for nothing i think i finished everything as you can see there is some wither skeleton spawning there and blazes of course but in general there's still not as much as i would like i think that may have to do with the length of this one that just not far enough to despawn the ones on one side and spawn new ones but yeah i've been placing buttons uh, all around here there you can see the buttons and that has improved a little bit uh, I'm going to continue doing that for the coming time. So whenever I feel like it, I'll place more and more buttons everywhere. So that hopefully will increase everything. Uh, you can see, whoop, is also hard at work placing buttons. Hi, honey. That is all I have for you this time. If you enjoyed our episode, or my episode in this case, please consider giving us a thumbs up. Uh, leave a comment and subscribe. It will really help our little channel out a lot. And hopefully... See you in the next one. I need to fix this. Bye bye. And with that last kill, we got our first Wither Skeleton Skull. So, uh -huh, uh -huh. it's working. The farm is working.